Yes, it is happening. Oh, Wonderful. Stand there and admire it. Twenty-seven thousand people here at Lords. Welcome to the hundred. Just going all the way. The first six of the hundred by Kate Cross. The hundred has been a long time coming for us. I was talking to the guys that normally only play county cricket as just a raise in quality, basically across the board. I've actually really loved the format and the challenges that it's shown. It's definitely blown all of our expectations on how good the crowds have been. And being out there in the middle has just been fantastic, incredible atmosphere. Everyone watching this all over the world definitely realised that it's going to be a massive tournament. It has already been a massive tournament this year so far and I reckon every international cricketer is going to want to be a part of it, which is obviously exactly what you want. You want the best of the best taking part in the best tournaments in the world. Beautiful shot from Mandanak. When you look at the tournament, you know, you've got some amazing overseas players. Um, you know, you've got the best talent in the country and uh, among some of the, you know, the best England players. Obviously, each of them are very different in their own right and the talent that they bring and the experience is second to none. So to have them around, pick their brains and, you know, each of them adds a lot to different areas to the team. Yeah! Bold, absolute beauty. Heather Knight just fired that one in straight. As an overseas player, there's a lot of pressure on yourself uh, to come into these competitions and perform, but I felt right at home. When you're living with each other, you're learning off each other all the time, and you know we've had lots of team barbecues and stuff, bonding-wise. Discussing the, uh, the cricket, the experience, has been amazing so far. And the group as a whole has stayed really tight and has a great culture for a group that only came together four weeks or so ago, I think. I think it's just one of them things where the more time you spend off the field and on the field together, it just sort of grows and builds. And that's really helped us on the field to perform and go back ourselves. Scoop. Scoops away over fine leg. Excellent manoeuvring of the field. One thing the 100 does do is it makes individual moments in the game a lot more important and it becomes a lot more about seizing those moments rather than having the best game overall. It's almost a full house here at Lords this evening. Oh, the frustration, the emotion of sport, the ups, the downs. The game was in the balance. I knew it was a very important over. I knew we really needed a wicket at that point. Well, you've got it. You've got Jordan now. Oh, my God! To be honest, when catches like that happen, don't really have any time to think about it. It's just a matter of my instincts uh, taking over. It really changed the game and swung it in our favour. The first game, the 92 not out. Jemima Rodriguez, she's putting on a masterclass right now. And winning it from, I think we were 18 for 4, 16 for 4, something like that. And the partnership I had with ADR, with Alice, I think that was special. It is one battle, the bowler versus the batter, in that one moment. And I think if you can remove all the external stuff that comes with cricket, the best players just manage to focus in on that moment. Yeah, hat-trick ball, Imran Tahir. Can he get a fiver? The image hat trick, uh, trying to chase him around Edge Baston was great fun. We'd all been waiting all tournament to see him run off, and the combination of his celebration and the crowd. Go on, son! That is brilliant! To finish a game off like that was pretty incredible. The atmosphere that night was unreal. We've probably got one of the most explosive teams. Myself, I'd like to put up there. Gone a long way up. Who's going to get there? I don't reckon anyone will. Oh, will she? Oh, she does. Catherine Brunson. off. She has just done a Usain Bolt there. She's oh. given us some reactions today, yeah. Catherine Brun. And now she's pumped. She's just adding that little bit more. I think it's added the entertainment and the excitement factor. Down the ground. It's the game. It's the match. 
Moving on to 2022, I always think if a team's done well, you try and retain the, the core players, and then you build on the success and you add a few players in and around. Liam Livingston, you hit a big ball. This year was quite a good foundation for us, and now next year we've you know figured out exactly how we want to play, and we're going to go out there and give it our all. The amount of people that start watching cricket is, is only going to go up.